First at five, this week the city of Boynton Beach approved a plan to add more red light cameras to busy roads to reduce speeding and crashes. WPTV News Channel 5's Brianna Nesprall shares how drivers are reacting to the idea. New to Boynton Beach, six more red light cameras. It's a long time coming. The goal is to catch red light runners on busy roads and intersections. It's dangerous. Diane Hay has seen firsthand accidents and almost accidents like this one all around the city. Speeding, taking red light. She says adding more of these cameras are a good idea. I think it will be a deterrent to some people and I think if we can reduce the numbers just a little bit, that's good. This comes after Tuesday's city commission meeting. In Palm Beach County, Boynton Beach is the only city that currently uses red light cameras, and that's after the city shut them down in early 2017 before bringing them back later that year. I think cameras are a good thing overall. There are already 15 red light cameras across the city. The new ones will be at Woolbright Road at South Seacrest Boulevard, North, East, and Westbound, West Boynton Beach Boulevard at Northwest 8th Street, Westbound, and Congress Avenue at Minor Road, North and Southbound. But some residents think this is all a trap. So it's really about money. Mark Hayden thinks the $158 ticket won't change the way people drive. People run red lights regardless, you know, whether they get a ticket or not. He says the ticket is just money for the city. Paying the fine is much easier than trying to take it to court. And, and you know, you can't dispute the digital evidence. So it's, yeah, people just pay the fine. Now officials say there will be a warning period so drivers have time to be aware of the new program. In Boynton Beach, I'm Brianna Nusbra, WPTV News Channel 5.